Another great day here in Millersburg, Indiana, right here on the campus of Rockwood and Flagstaff. We are going to today feature my favorite fifth wheel. It's a Flagstaff Super Light 529 RLKS. It weighs 9,400 pounds. It's 30 feet, uh, 36 feet long, tip to tail. Uh, the, the tongue weight is 1,456 pounds. And there's so many great features about this camper. When you go inside, you're going to understand what I say. If you're the focal part of your campground, if you have groups of people that come and congregate in your camper at the campground, or even have four or five campers around you in the middle of nowhere, and they all uh, come into your camper. This is the fifth wheel from you for you. Let's just go ahead and get started Just like all the rest of our great fifth wheels all the things I'm going to say here are All included on every super light fifth wheel So starting out with the number one feature you got to hook it up to your truck to pull it to where you want to go, right? That's why it's a, a fifth wheel camper turning point from LCI what that does is it gives you 22 extra inches of turning radius for that short bed pickup truck. So you don't have to use it. You can leave it locked into its position or you can unlock that front tongue and it can move around and give you a whole bunch more space. Also, painted front cap, beautiful light in the front. Got great accents this year. We spent a lot of time on our decal package to make it look great. So when you're going down the road, it really looks awesome. Right here in the front, we have our front storage with electric stab jacks and all the plugs are very, very convenient. Right in the front here is our front solar plug. So if you want to do a suitcase panel out front, you're ready to go. All you have to do is plug it in. It's got an SAE port to it. Moving down the camper, we've got one 30 pound bottle of LP on each side of the camper. Okay, makes it super easy to get in and out. You don't have to, to wrestle around to get underneath. Slam latch hinges on all your, your uh, baggage doors. So important, you can never uh, ruin or break a hole in metal. It'll slam right in there. Good for a thousand shuts. Just keep going ahead and closing this up. Big doors with magnets, so very important. As we move over, one of the things I like to call the Millersburg differences, we go above and beyond, okay? Let's start right here at the step, the mole ride step. You can lift this, I'll open this door here. You can lift this mole ride step with two fingers. Then it easily comes out with just a pull to adjust at your campsite. You can't get easier than that. It makes it so incredibly easy and it's convenient. All the weight's on the ground, it's not in your camper. So if somebody walks in your camper, it doesn't feel like it's rocking and rolling you all the time, okay? That's one thing we do. Second, a shade in your window. That shade is great for security, it keeps out sunlight, uh, you can have it down if you don't want anybody to see it, or you can bring it, bring it up if you want to see out and see what's happening in your camper, okay? Uh, we've got the sure shot where your, your screen always shuts by itself. You never have to worry about flies or other things getting in. It's just gonna automatically shut for you. So when we talk about the Millersburg difference and little things we do better, key to like system. These are the only two keys you get with your camper. You, it's really, really simple. You, you don't have a big ring of keys, eight, 10 different keys um, on one key ring that you jingle in your pocket. Really super simple, okay? Key to like system, very important. And then one thing I love, friction hinge door. Really hard wind, slams that door, it doesn't break. But you know what, some days it's just really windy out. So not only do we give you the friction hinge, but we give you the door stop too, to guarantee that's not gonna shut. Find another camper that gives you friction hinge and the door stop. It's just a little something we do extra here at, at uh, Flagstaff. So moving on from the door, another baggage compartment. You're gonna find that anywhere we can put extra storage for you, the camper, we're always talking about storage. Believe me, when people come to us and all the calls they get every day from customers are seeing customers out in the field, we're always talking about storage because you wanna take things with you, right? You're camping, chairs, grills, all sorts of fun stuff. Always giving you as many doors as humanly possible. What's the most important part of safety in driving your camper down the road. Number one, literally, it's where the rubber meets the road. Goodyear Endurance Tires, right here on every single fifth wheel that we make at Flagstaff and Rockwood. So, very important tire, um, does a great job. Then you have your Torsion Flex axles underneath there. It's an independent suspension. I know we talk about Torsion Flex axles. We spend a lot of money and a lot of effort on it. It's the Millersburg difference. 
time, effort, and safety is paramount for you, for you the customer. So we're gonna give you the best tire on the best axle. And we'll go over the construction of the box later, but then you give you the best box on top, you're gonna have the most comfortable, safest, easiest driving camper there is out there. All of our slides, our laminated sidewalls, they're not a built hung sidewall. They don't have that, that uh, ugly looking metal here that slides off and, and doesn't look very good. This is actually laminated pieces with insulation in them. A great big rack and pinion um, slide system. Super easy to use. Doesn't take a lot of maintenance. Doesn't fail on you. We always over beef it up with a bigger engine or a bigger motor actually underneath the camper. And that's out of the moisture and the rain and uh, any of the, the wetness that maybe comes up underneath your camper because it is heated in enclosed underbelly with tank heaters on everything. We'll go over that in a little bit too. A couple speakers out here just for your entertainment pleasure. And as we move to the back of the camper, we're always gonna have a spray port for you somewhere. So in the front, you connect this, it's got hot and cold water. Uh, it's so great just to, to wash your dog off, uh, clean out some dishes outside. Try to really uh, emphasize being outside, because that's what you do want to do when you're camping, is be outside and enjoying nature and the weather. So you've got a, a accessory hitch right on the back on every model. Um, you can also get a bike rack. This particular model does not have one, that is an option. So you can either use that or the, the rack that comes down uh, fully walkable roof, one piece roof. We're gonna get into that in the inside, all of our construction, but we got a ladder. We want you to get on the roof. We want you to check in those seals or somebody doing it if it's not particularly you to make sure everything's going right up there. Um, we're not afraid of people walking up there on that one piece roof. Very, very, very solid. Um, LED lights in the back here and just a, a backup camera prep. You can go ahead and get a Furion backup camera in there so you can see everything that's happening behind you when you put that truck into reverse or your vehicle into, uh, your tow vehicle into reverse. Keeping safety uh, just uh, paramount in every facet that we do. Laminated back wall, that's so very important. But this keeps the structure all in line. And actually when this is built, when you bring it up, they make sure it's level with the machine on the frame. And then they attach the back wall in the roof that makes sure that all the corners are square and in the proper engineering uh, sequence that they wanna be. And that's really neat to see on the, on the floor. Maybe we can show you that sometime in one of our factories is them squaring it up. But uh, this is pretty much all the contents that make up just this side. The other side's just like the other side, tons of baggage, easy convenience center, big water heater you can see over on that side. But uh, now we'll head on inside and we'll talk about some of the great attributes of this camper inside. So, now that we're inside this Flagstaff Superlight fifth wheel, what I'd like to do is take a little time and talk about the construction of all of our fifth wheel Superlight models. So if you start from, we already talked about awesome tire, awesome axles, torsion flex axles, up into the frame. Let's talk a little bit about what carries all our contents, the box, so to speak. It's always gonna be block foam insulation, it's gonna be inch and a half thick. It's going to be all aluminum. Nothing in any of our units is ever not aluminum. If it bears weight, bed, this bench, something else, it's always gonna be aluminum or sidewalls and slide outs, okay? That makes sure that you have the best construction humanly possible. No wood being pieced together with screws or anything like that, with anything that bears weight. So let's start at the back wall. We already discussed that's laminated. Let's talk about the roof. One piece laminated walkable roof. So we have a special machine that we laminate the roof in that's got curvature to it. It's, not, it's unlike any other machine in the market. It does a great job. All of our roofs here at Rockwood Flagstaff are laminated and they're fully walkable. The best way to make a roof is laminated. So roof flooring. 5 8 inch tongue and groove deck that's screwed and glued. Everybody knows that when you screw it in, it's just holding the glue down until it takes hold because it's got so much more adhesive power. So this floor is just like a residential floor you would have in your house. A great Congolian flooring on top of it, scratch resistant, stain resistant, scuff resistant. All the great things about it, just spill a glass of uh, juice, you wipe it up, it's gone. Kids bring in rocks, it won't scuff on you. It's got a little memory to it, so when you push those stones in that you pick up on the campground, it's gonna come right back. Awesome, 
awesome building materials here. Slide outs, all built with laminated pieces, all aluminum. Every single slide out you're gonna find is that construction. So what we're giving you is not only the best undercarriage in the business, but the toughest and strongest box in the business. So with that being said, and all the great attributes of all the construction, let's check out this awesome floor plan. If you are the centerpiece of your campground, you're gonna love this unit. So sitting here at this four person bar top, lots of space here, lots of great space over there, beautiful backsplash. Look at the fit and finish on those cabinets. It's just so user friendly. We could have went three, or three cabinets all the way across straight, but no, nice little panache piece right in the middle, finished at the top with a great, great uh, crown molding there. Max air fan moves 900 feet of air per minute. It's gonna move all that air out when you have all these bodies in here. So let's just check it out. So you've got your galley right here with a great 22 inch oven, nice cooktop here, great big refrigerator. We talk about the Millersburg difference. I'm gonna show you this closet, just a small piece. Maybe other people do it, maybe they don't. But the light should come on when I open this up. I don't have to touch anything. When you open the door, the light comes on in this huge pantry of a closet. You're gonna be feeding 10 people, you need a lot of closet space. Really, just one of those really nice features. Great shelving, little lip on here. Going on the road, things are jiggling, they're not gonna fall out of here. Millersburg difference, so very important. So as we enter, now the living space, we've got a double theater seat right here, fantastic. It's got lumbar supports. Then you've got a hide -a bed sofa and a hide -a bed sofa. So you can literally sit comfortably watching this enormous TV. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. And then these fold out. If you're uh, a family that brings some people some of the time and entertains other times, these both fold out into a really, really nice bed. Sleeping four in here, let alone from the bedroom in the very back. So as you're looking at the entertainment center, a wonderful fireplace, really nice cabinets, some open, some closed to put things in, very decorative, great big television, um, great speakers here with your sound system right in here. This is where people congregate and fun and camping and life happen. This is where the laughs happen. This is where the memories are made right in this room. So let's head on up into the bedroom. As we go to the bedroom, I wanted to point out one thing, hidden hinges inside here, very residential, nice, nice clean look on the sides here. This decor right here is a Newport Ashwood, so very popular, people are loving it. Moving up the steps, Millersburg difference, handrail. Walk into another fifth wheel, you'd be surprised how many fifth wheels on the market don't have a simple handrail. It's easy, it's simple, it goes right beside your convenience center, up into the bedroom. We've got a place for a TV here, some beautiful cabinets here, a big size queen bed. And I just wanna show you real quick, remember how I promised anything that bared weight would have aluminum? Aluminum, aluminum, aluminum. On a hinge with a handle. Millersburg difference, right there. Says it all the time, okay? Put that handle down, really easy to get underneath your bed. I'm gonna work my way into the bathroom from the other side here. Remember how we talked about in our last segment, flexibility of campers? We have so many new campers in the market, which is a wonderful thing. We're so excited for new campers. Ask questions, ask your neighbors questions, ask us questions. But what we're gonna come to is a lot of campgrounds are gonna be full. So we need to create units where you're flexible. You can stay in somebody's driveway if you don't want to uh, intrude their space in their home. You can stay in a parking lot somewhere. You can stay in the middle of the wilderness. This little feature, the, um, the AquaView shower miser, what it is is a water reclaiming system, okay? This brings water and it filters it back in through the fresh water tank until this becomes white and it becomes hot. That way you're not wasting all your fresh water on a shower and then it going into your gray tank. It's a really great little feature. So let's say you wanna go camping on the weekend, all the campgrounds are closed, let's save our water so we, we don't have to go over and refill all the time. 
a great little system. And of course the bathroom's incredible. Hidden hinges, we didn't cloak and dagger you and not put a nice hidden hinge on maybe a cabinet in the bathroom. Max air fan again, moves a lot of air. Porcelain toilet, huge shower here. We have an extension. We could have stopped the slide right here, but we extended it out to give you a bigger linen space for towels and different storage inside the bathroom and the bedroom. Such great little features. So let's walk on into the bedroom here. As we talk about flexibility, we want to make sure that you're comfortable sleeping in your coach, okay? So we're always going to have an outlet on each side of the bed. CPAP machines. It's reality of society. We're going to accommodate you. This is a little bit higher of a deck over here, a little bit lower, but both accommodate a plug-in, which is fantastic. Three drawers here and just nice little chest of drawers, then tons of sport, uh, space and storage up above. Again, hidden hinge that looks so nice, doesn't it? So smooth. You got a slider door right here. This model just does everything. And when we talk about flexibility in your campgrounds, it's 36 feet long. You can get into most campgrounds, most trucks. You don't need a huge dually to pull it. It's a nice uh, size weight. It's under 10,000 pounds. So a lot of trucks can pull it anywhere you want to go on all the great uh, construction and, and features of this particular floor plan. If you want any more information, you can go to forestriverinc.com and look at all our floor plans at Rockwood and Flagstaff. Thanks for taking your time with me today. Have a good one.